Hey there, my name is Kenny, I'm with Structured Solutions, and today I'm going to walk you through installing SSI tools for the first time. Now the first thing that you're going to have to do is it, download the setupssitools.exe file. That's going to be the file that you're going to run that's going to install the SSI tools files onto your computer. If you don't already have this file, there'll be a link in the description of this video of how to get it. Once you've downloaded this, all you need to do is click on it to run. That's going to open up an installation wizard. It will look like this. On the first page, we're going to click I accept the agreement. Then we're just going to next our way through the prompts. So click the next button on each one of these prompts. Then we'll click the install button once we get to here. SSI Tools will now install all of its necessary components onto the computer. We'll click Next. This last window has two options that are going to be automatically checked. One says Launch SSI Tools for MS Project, and one says Launch SSI Presentation Professional. Now what this installer just did is it put all of the necessary files for SSI Tools to run on your computer. So it installed all those files onto your computer. There is an additional step that needs to occur for the actual add-ins to load in the Microsoft Office applications. That's what these checkboxes are referring to. So these are going to launch two additional in installer windows once we click Finish if we have these checked. So keep these checked and then click the Finish button. Now you'll see two windows. They're going to get stacked on top of each other, but they're going to look like this. Before we click the install button on either of these windows, we want to make sure that we click here where it says Structured Solutions Incorporated. Now, this is important for those of you who are working at any organization that requires Office add-ins to be uh, signed by a trusted publisher. If you don't follow this next step that I'm about to show you, SSI tools will not load on your computer. So I'm going to go ahead and click this. This just gives details of the Structured Solutions Code Signing Certificate. No need to read any of the details here, just click the Install Certificate button. We're going to keep this option set to Current User. Then I'm going to check the option that says Place All Certificates in the Following Store. Click Browse here. And you want to find the folder called Trusted Publishers. Once you've done that, select it, then click the OK button. Then we'll click the next button, then we'll click the finish button, and you should get a window that opens up that says the import was successful. Once that occurs, we'll click OK and click OK again. Now we're free to click the install button here on both of these windows. Once the windows say the Microsoft Office customization was successfully installed, we can go ahead and close these. Now we're ready to open up Microsoft Project. Go ahead and just find the Microsoft Project icon, click on it to open the application. You can go to any project that you'd like. In my case here, I'm just going to open a blank project. Now the first thing that you should see after SSI Tools has been installed for the first time when you open Project is this window here that will say thank you for using SSI Tools. Uh, please select from the following options. So we have an option to start a free trial or to enter a license key. If we have a license key already, we can go ahead and click this option here. If we don't have a license key, then we're going to click the option that says start free trial. You're able to use the full features of SSI tools for 30 days before you have to enter in a license key. In my case, I do have a license key, so I'm going to click the option that says enter license key. Uh, in the top box, you're going to enter in your work email address. So in my case, I'll just do... And then go ahead and plug in the key. Then all you need to do is click the button that says Validate License Key.
If the validation was successful, you'll see this message that says the activation was successful. Again, if this is the very first time that you've ever activated SSI tools, you'll see uh, additional text here that will tell you that an SSITools.com has been created for you and information on how to log into that account uh, has been emailed to you. And that's really all that there is to it. You'll notice here that I now have the SSI Tools ribbon here in Project. I'm free to use any of the features of SSI Tools. However, just to make sure that everything installed correctly, I'm also going to open PowerPoint. And I'm going to make sure that I have a tab in PowerPoint that says SSI Presentation Pro, which I do here. That's great. And then I'll also open up Excel. And I'm going to make sure that I have a tab that says SSI Tools here in Excel as well. If you have all of those tabs, then you're all good to go. I hope this video was helpful and thank you again so much for using SSI Tools. We really appreciate it.